John, what a facility you've got here. I know this is one of two that you have. So what machines have you got in this facility? So we've got many different makes of machines. We've got Matsuras, Morisikis, Haas, Doosan, star sliding head machines. Wow, <laughs> you've got it all really. From anything from three axis all the way up to full five axis. Full five axis, yes. We've got single and twin spindle lathes as well, along with sliding head lathes. And in this facility, it's small of your smaller parts, but what's happening over on the other side? So at our XL facility, um, as the name suggests, we're working in a much larger scale. So we tend to work down there with motorsport, large castings, engine castings, gearbox castings um, for motorsport and um, Formula One applications. Well, you're really trying to conquer all the different industries. And I know recently you've had to diversify. Why is this? So we've diversified um, many years ago um, as a requirement to keep the business lean. Um, we were operating scientific, medical, um, packaging, um, and more recently aerospace and defence um, areas. We've always had a mantra here that there is no bad time to invest. So even last year uh, during COVID, we made the investment of a new Matsura milling machine. Wow. And this year is going to be very, very similar. Any more investments that you're making? Yes, this year we hope to invest into a, a, a larger um, turning machine, a turning centre uh, with driven tool capability and also a fibre laser cutting system. Fantastic. And that's, of course, the hardware side of things. But what about the software? So we've invested into some new programming software to go along with our new five axis machine, um, which has been very successful. So we're, we're able to program much more complex parts uh, with simultaneous machining. So our shear line having growth as a company and why do you think that is? It's difficult to say Lindsay, uh, certainly uh, without doubt we are seeing growth. Um, effects of Brexit possibly one thing, a lot of customers are looking to bring their work back to the UK. We've certainly seen that in a number of cases. Wow really? And what about going forward? Have you, you know, you've got some great apprentices on your shop floor. Are you investing in them too? Absolutely. At the end of the day, our workforce is our future. Um, and we've always invested heavily within our apprenticeship program. Every year we try to take on at least four new apprentices. So what would you say to someone if they were looking to bring new work to yourselves? What is it that Shearline do that's unique in the industry? Shearline can offer you a unique service. Shearline has so many things under one roof, not just the machine shop you can see around us. We also have a full sheet metal and fabrication service. On top of that, we can do uh, electromechanical assemblies, so we can actually make something almost from start to finish.